Hi everyone, we are here at RDH Under One Roof 2021 and I am thrilled to be speaking with Peggy of Sertal. Welcome. Oh, welcome Amber. It's always so good to see you and we're happy to have you right here at the Sertal booth uh, so we can talk a little bit about our infection control products. Let's dive in. I'm excited to be here. And what do you want to cover first? So one of the things that we've been featuring for this show is our shield mask. So this is a great level three mask. Uh, we're really excited about this because it has such great comfort and utility uh, for dental settings. Um, helps with aerosol protection. So it's a really a wonderful sh uh, alternative uh, in the mask world. So that's one of our products that we're featuring. And then another product that we're featuring is our disinfectant. We have an entire family of disinfectants, so they're both wipes and liquids, and they're water-based, very safe for equipment and people. Um, we've been actually showing folks how the uh, product is very safe for equipment and actually for your skin. Uh, we're the people that are exposed to disinfectants and chemicals all day long in the office, and it's really important to be considering the types of chemicals that you are exposed to, uh, along with also, of course, always understanding that you have to have chemicals to actually kill germs, too. Right. So uh, the germs are the hidden enemy, and we definitely want to kill them, but we don't want to kill ourselves and the equipment well, while course. we're doing it. Yep. And we do have lots of other products that are involved in cleaning and infection control. We have detergents, we have uh, products for cleaning instrumentation, and we have quite a variety of those. Uh, we also have products for cleaning the evacuation lines, and that's become quite an issue lately, and we have several choices for that. Again, um, it's the importance of understanding the chemicals that actually will do the effective cleaning. Um, we find that people get attached to certain brands or even colors and maybe do not really understand the actual chemicals that they're using. Right. So, you know, along with being here at the show and getting a chance to meet everybody, we're also trying to do lots of education and explain, you know, well, what is this chemical? How does it work? And, and why should you choose this chemical over that chemical? So uh, a lot of it is uh, just understanding what you're actually using okay. right. and then making good choices from there. Right, exactly. We, of course, want it to be effective for our patients and killing the bacteria that could put us all at harm. But it's, I think it is very important, especially as a practice owner. You know, my practice owner is constantly concerned about what we're putting on the leather of the chair and making sure that it's going to last long. So great work that you've done. It's phenomenal. Anything else that we need to know specifically about the wipes? Well, I think another issue that we've run across, uh, really everybody here has mentioned it, is the difficulty of actually getting supply. <laughs> yes. The supply chain <laughs> is crazy. It is. Uh, for both masks and disinfectants and really other products as well. What is not well understood is that the struggle that the manufacturers have had, even to get the materials, the uh, white towelette material or the canister itself, or even some of the chemicals that go into making the formula. Right. So the supply chain's been crazy, and we have secured a really excellent supply chain for many of our products. So we have the canisters, we have the white material. We actually have U.S. manufactured masks. So this is such a wonderful security for people who choose to use our Sertel products that they will have the security of having a good, steady, reliable supply chain. And, and that's gold. Well, that is also <laughs> essential when it comes to infection control because you each recommendation <laughs> on how you use the product is different. Mm -hmm. So you want to ensure that when you're establishing those clinical protocols, you can rely on the product to be there moving forward. Exactly, exactly. It's just uh, always so much fun to be here at RDH and uh, getting a chance to visit with my dental hygiene peeps. <laughs> um, I love to relate with them and, and all their little struggles and triumphs and uh, as well as you, of course, yourself because uh, we're all in this together, literally. Yes. <laughs> and it, uh, you, um, the clinical user, you have to rely on the manufacturer yes. to be reliable and effective. We yes. have to give you good materials to work with because once you're in the trenches, once you're at chairside, um, you have to be able to trust that you have good products. Absolutely, you, didn't, mm -hmm. you couldn't say it better, and we thank you for doing the hard, the hard work of establishing a product that's gonna keep us safe and our patients safe. Oh, thank you, Amber. You're yeah. welcome. Where do people go for to learn more information? So, uh, Sertal International, like just about every other company, we do have a website, uh, and that would be www.sertal.com. 
and then we also have a very uh, effective customer service uh, at, at our business. So we have an 800 number, 800-843-3343. And we actually answer the phone with real live people. Whoa! How shocking. <laughs> so uh, so folks can call, they can get education, they can get product information, uh, they can find out which dealers to go to, uh, who's available that actually provides the products. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for your time and your commitment to the dental hygiene community. We're oh, better with you. You're very welcome, Lambert. So good to talk with you.